Hey everyone, it's Don from Crux Terminatus. This is a video to say thank you so much to every one of our 500 subs. Uh, and this is the second Praetor. Um, I can't believe I, I, I've gone and done it. Head to Forge World uh, if you want to see some more uh, of these uh, pictures. Uh, a good friend of mine um, uh, said that they wanted to see me paint blue because uh, it was their favourite colour. So I said, right, okay, I'm going to get stuck right in here with uh, my new surface primer from Vallejo. So this is it in its raw uh, form and I actually quite like that colour but I needed to go and do the shadows with uh, Imperial Blue. You'll have seen there that the, um, the comms unit on his uh, belt was really, really badly cast. But this is me just putting the, um, the shadows on uh, for the later, lighter colours which come now. So I, I go through a couple of layers, you can see the wet paint there, it dries in a really, really quick time. And then it was more onto a mix of that and electric blue to uh, to get that highlight colour. Just shooting down uh, with the Zenith uh, method of highlighting. So i uh, actually quite enjoying this, uh, this paint. I've, edge highlighting with um, electric blue. I think that looks really, really nice. And then obviously a blue wash to bring everything uh, back down. So I asked a very special friend of mine what colour they would like me to paint and uh, they said blue. So um, this is why um, I've gone and invented a chapter called the Sons of Redemption. And you'll see me freehand uh, two teardrops uh, to signify the pain. Uh, of the the heresy uh, in their past. So it's the first time I've ever tried to freehand anything, uh, especially iconography, so um, it, I think it works out all right. In the meantime, it's uh, on to Mechrite Red for the uh, tabard. I just thought the red would be a really nice contrast color. And then um, I thought the, the nice white uh, of the Aquila would, would be you know, a nice contrast as well. Um, quite watery paints there. Uh, so you'll see me freehand uh, there and I was thinking about you know how I could do uh, the teardrop and, and what it actually signifies. Um, I, I quite like it, um, you know, the teardrops obviously they're talisman so you know they're going to have it on, on everything, all their, all their tanks, all their planes, all that kind of stuff. So this is Mithril Silver just to, to pick out some of the details against the, uh, the red. quite like the contrast, I love the stance uh, of, the, of the model but the pair of them together, the two Praetors sit together, or standing together should I say, uh, really really look good. I just wish I, I had a 30k army that I could actually run them in. Um, you'll notice as well that I've uh, sponge chipped uh, the armour as well. I, I had to do that off camera because uh, unfortunately my memory card was a, a bit full. Uh, so a dry brush of rotten flesh. Um, I do that a couple of times because it just seems to, to, to dry uh, quite a bit darker than you see going on just now and you'll see I've had to freehand in this uh, his radio or his comm unit or whatever because half of it was completely miscast. So now we're on to the assembly stage. Um, I always get to this part and rush it because you know I'm so close to the finishing line I really want to get it finished, I want to do the video, I want to get it up online. Uh, but this time I really really enjoyed it, I was enjoying the feeling of uh, being quite satisfied uh, and quite happy. Um, you know, it's it's a rare occurrence for me to be uh, quite happy like that. So, yay for me being happy. Uh, and that's uh, that's the guy you'll see there is uh, his special sort of hand cannon thing, bit of a Nova gun if you ask me, um, and his uh, power sword, uh, which incidentally the handle had snapped off, so I had to, to reattach uh, that. So as for the Sons of Redemption and their uh, teary background. Hopefully the future is a bit brighter for them now, um, and I'd like to say that you know he looks a bit battered, a bit worn. You know he's seen plenty of conflicts in the in the last I don't know 18 years, um, something like that, um, and obviously he's just about to get bumped when a Primark comes along. But that's him. I really really like the build. I love the the other model as well. Um, and strangely enough, looking back on this this build here. I really suck at heads and faces, but the um, the red uh, Terminator uh, face and eyes look brilliant there. Um, which um, look at me, Mr. Big Head. Um, but no, I really, really quite like them, and I love the fact that they're dirty, they're battered, they're bashed, and they've been um, giving people the, the close-up good news for for a very long period of time. So thanks again, guys, for sticking with uh, Roddy and I through uh, the last couple of years. 
before Christmas last year we were struggling to get to 300 subs and um, already we're at 500 so we're we're thinking about doing a giveaway we'd love to do one for you you know we don't get sponsored or anything it's, it's our own money but we'd love to say thank you so please comment if you would like us to do a, a, a yes or no uh, giveaway so thanks please like comment subscribe share with all your friends uh, it really makes it worthwhile thanks bye bye